And also in week number three, we have prepared some practical hands-on sessions for you. Yes, so we will start with query knowledge graphs and in the first hands-on we will query the one of the most famous knowledge graph out there, the Wikidata. We will take a look at the constraints, visualizations that uh, Wikidata provides. We will also do it through the call-up notebook so you can also try it out and yeah, find out more about data in Wikidata. We also continue with the DBpedia and see the difference between the both knowledge graphs, how to query them and um, yes, hope you find it interesting as well. Yes, and then we have a third hands-on session for you where we talk about Sparkle Query Federation. Here also you get a collab notebook from us and here we go away from only querying Wikidata or DBpedia as these large knowledge graphs. We will also take a look at smaller ones. For example, there's linked stage graph in there, which is yeah, um, a graph that contains data about performing arts. And here we will see how we can connect also this data to Wikidata. And then in another example, we will talk about the GND and also see how we can connect that to Wikidata to further enrich also the data we have in smaller and more domain specific knowledge graphs. And now let's start. And in the first lecture, we will talk about how to query RDFS with Sparkle.